Yo, what's up boys and welcome to my first ever video on the Saisin Alpha live server. I know you guys thought we've been doing nothing for the past month and that the new map was never going to come out, the new framework was never going to come out, but today I'm happy to present to you guys courtesy of Ben and my other compadres here uh, the first ever footage of the Alpha build. Show you some features, some new builds, some new weapons, some new vehicles, stuff like that. Uh, in fact, right in front of us right now you can see the beautiful Nazaki Police Headquarters made by Kangaroo. You can see it's, it's Nazaki Police right there. We've also got a custom building coming very soon. I think it's actually ready uh, to be put in the map which is for the fire station right do you guys know yep. yeah i can't really hear him too well he's whispering that's okay anyway um so in this video i'm going to show you some features i'm going to talk about how you can get access to the alpha build in fact i'll just tell you right now um i don't know exactly when it's going to be coming out it's going to be coming out soon tm but it's pretty much ready to go at this point if i go ahead and open up my map right now you will see that the entire map is populated um with various different things on it you can see the you know island on oh, nazaki island correction facility over there um, it is using a different framework, so I don't know exactly how everything works, but we're going to work out most of that stuff in this video. Uh, but yeah, if you want to apply for Alpha, there will be a link to the forums below. Uh, and essentially the way it works is there's a VIP section. So if you VIP, then you get pretty much guaranteed to get in because it's a very short list. Or you can do it if you're not a VIP as well. I have links to both of those in the description. You do also need uh, Cup Terrain's Call. And if you want to join the TeamSpeak and get help with anything, then the TS is tsfree.sysin.com. You can check out all that stuff in the description below. But anyway, the thing which I'm most excited for, which I wanted to show right at the start of this, was the new cuffing system. I think it's something which is all sucked in armor and I don't know why it hasn't been made now. Um, as much as you guys say our developers have done nothing in the past month, you know, who was it? It was Nicholas, right, who made this system? Nicholas, yeah. yeah. Nicholas Jafoski. Jif He's made this cuffing system right here, which you can see allows, uh, I, what's your name again? You are Quin Quintrell, yeah. Quintrell right here, you can see he can walk around. Don't shoot me. No, don't shoot. You can walk around, uh, you can walk forwards, you can change stances, and all of this is happening while he's restrained. In this case, we actually gave him a gun, uh, just because I think it's pretty funny. But obviously, um, if you do tie someone up, you probably want to take the gun off them. But if this guy finds a gun when he's restrained, he can actually go ahead and shoot people. Like he's going to go ahead and demonstrate on Ben right here quickly. Okay, Quintrell, go ahead and shoot Repents. I don't know why he's shooting Repents instead of Ben, but, you know. So as you can see, he's now unconscious. It says beside his name. This is very useful. I don't know why it makes a tasing noise. Kind of weird, but the point is you can do it. And you'll see if I press uh, tab on people, I can open up the cu cuffs if I've got the um, handcuff keys. And I can also cuff them if I want. I can also check out citizen info, which is really important. When you first join a server, you get to uh, register as a citizen, where you can put your name, your second name, your country of birth, your gender, your middle initial, your date of birth, which you were born a thousand years ago now. That's pretty good. And all that kind of stuff. So I can do that with, with everyone. So if I want to go ahead and repent this, so I can cuff you quickly. Want to go ahead and cuff repents i can do that and then uh, i can go ahead and check out his his information so that's that system's pretty cool you know the main thing we're trying to look or the main thing which i said to the developers when we're making this is trying to make something which is like different you know it people make life sales every single day i'm not going to say any specific names but most of them are like exactly the same they don't do anything different like even if it's slightly different that's good so we can go ahead and uh, go on repents right now do citizen info and we can see all his information which he placed as well and if i want i can even do that for myself and see my information which i placed so all this information you write down when you first join the server and then ben made the system i know you've got like multiple characters can you make more than one character or how does that work uh yeah up to two characters and oh. yeah oh, okay. so everything's split all your information like your warrants and everything split across them but you'll share your money across them and just okay things, like your house and stuff. yeah and then a few other things i can show as well as you can give cash as well so if i want to give them 500 dollars then i can go and do that so you'll now have 500 dollars you'll see i'll lose 500 dollars on my bottom right and you can also give someone a name you'll know this system from a3pl i don't know if there's any other which has this system that i know but essentially you don't know people's name when you first meet them so you can't be like oh my god i love you lewis suck my cock so i'm gonna call ben uh, lewis right now and you can see he's now called lewis and that's that's pretty much that. Um, I can't think of anything else I'm missing. I guess we can show the bikes quickly. You guys can go ahead and get on the bikes. Um, Repent, you're going to have to stay off the bike. I'm sorry. So Ben's going to go ahead and get on the bike. You can't move? That's fine. Uh, you can stay cuffed as well. I'll just be me and Ben on the bikes. You guys just chill here, okay? And the special thing about these bikes is you can press G. Obviously, we didn't make the bikes, but you, oh, you just killed Repent. Good job. You can go on the bike, and uh, you can press G, and then you do a wheelie. And the great thing about these bikes is the, uh, the, the, the wheel doesn't actually go down unless you press S. So, um, yeah, basically you can just do a wheelie forever. I think that's pretty sweet. And, uh, 
along with these bikes as well. I don't know which bike is from which pack, but essentially we did also buy a bunch of vehicles from a nice man, which I forgot the name of because he's just way too nice. Well, those guys are still cuffed on the floor. I just think it's huge to be able to walk while cuffed. It's a real, like, immersion breaker, in my opinion, when you cuff someone and you have to, like, pick them up and move them. So obviously you still do need to value your life and stuff like that, but um, it's pretty cool that you are now able to uh, move while cuffed, which will be a thing for civilians and also for cops. Like, I'm actually a civilian right now. So we're going to go and toast uh, Mr. I don't know now. I called him I don't know a while ago. And you'll see this is a flamethrower. Flamethrower's pretty nice. Um, are these guys fine? Uh, oh, he's in, he's in the fire now. Is he okay? I've got gone right on. Oh, nice. Good job. Good job. What about what about this guy? I don't repeat. repeat I mean, he's not talking. Hello? Do you have god mode, sir? Oh, shoot repeat. Shoot repeat. I mean, oh. I, you don't have god mode on. Oh. Then why are you not dying? He has god mode on. Do you have god mode on? Are you sure? I see the own for him. Oh my god, early access, dude. Jesus Christ, man. I don't know why he's even turning God Mode on as if like someone's gonna come over and RDM us on an empty fucking server. Doesn't make any sense. Anyway, uh, showing off a few more vehicles. We bought these vehicles from a nice fan, which I've got the name of, like I said. So we've got the undercover police vehicle, which has sirens in it. So you can go ahead and, you know, turn on your code freeze if you want. The back door doesn't open or anything like that, but the cool thing about this thing right here is the back door does open. You can also shoot at the back of it. I don't know if I've seen these vehicles before, but you can see we paid for them because it's Sison.com. Sison.com. So, um, someone paid for these vehicles. I'm not entirely sure who, but, you know, great lad, whoever that is. And let's have a quick look inside the police station, and then we're going to go show off some other features. Um, I don't know how much stuff of interest, really, we're going to show today. Anyway, uh, Nizaki Police Department. Uh, so if you logged in is a police officer, which I could go ahead and do like this. I just go ahead and go on duty, and you'll see in the bottom right, it'll turn to police officer if you've got whitelisting for it. If you don't have whitelisting, it doesn't show up. You can open up the doors and do other shit. Uh, and you also got a firearm registry as well. So, although I've already got a firearm, essentially, if you buy a, car, uh, buy a house, uh, a license, or anything like that, you need to go ahead and pay for it and then put your signature at the bottom. So, that's how that works. And let's go inside the police station quickly and show you that. So, the big thing about police stations, I think, is. Most of them on other servers don't have cells. So these have got cells which you can open and close. We've got a garage over here. We've got a meeting room over here. And upstairs we've got a bunch of um, offices as well. Which are all very conveniently called uh, the kangaroo office. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. Yeah, kangaroo offices. So these are just kangaroo, 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 kangaroo. Because kangaroo just like loves himself. So he put like a million kangaroo offices. We've got counter-terrorism over here. And we've also got uh, tactical over there. Whatever the fuck that is. So I don't know how many of these... Um, how many of these, or how many uh, uniforms are in right now, which are actually custom as well. But there is definitely, like, custom Nazaki uniforms. In fact, I could just show them on, the, on Arsenal, which actually say Nazaki on them. In fact, no, I'm wearing one right now. Yeah, you can see right there. It says Nazaki um, Division Tactical Unit, and it says Watch Your Back or some shit. Like, that literally looks like fucking Comic Sans, so I made that. Uh, but yeah, you know, it's early access, but um, I think throughout the, you know, the testing period, which is going to be required roleplay... But obviously, you know, things will be changed and shit like that. We should be able to come out with a, a pretty uh, nice product at the end of it. Many of these things aren't necessarily even in-game, but this uh, shield right here was made by Quintrell, right? Let's yeah. see, does it work? Nice, it works. He's a genius. So this is like the biggest shield I've ever seen, and it works. It looks pretty cool, but it also looks pretty fucking shit, so I don't know, man. Um, what else do we have to show? I think the only other thing we've got to show is the, the dumper truck. Uh, you will also notice that the sounds, the ambient sounds and all the gun sounds are a bit different. That's a JSRS sound mod, so that's different as well. You know, as a whole, just trying to move away from Malden and start fresh. Because let's be honest, Malden was pretty fucking shit. This map, if you haven't seen it before, is called um, Nozaki Island, made by uh, Connor Sullivan. And it's definitely got some um, lakeside influence, but you'll see it's kind of flipped sideways. This is Lakeside, this is Springfield, this is Morrison. Uh, this is where the DOC is over here. I could show you a random map quickly, but I did show it like a few months ago. Um, in, oh, I just teleport shit. I showed it a few months ago in a video, so it's not really too much of a point. But it's a pretty well-made map, I'd say. There's still some things which are going to be changed. What is this building? I've never... What is this? I've never seen this building before. What the fuck? Dude, I've never seen this. Um, I, I don't know where this building came from, but it's came from somewhere. Also, we are going to be buying some bridges, which are on the screen right now. In fact, I may as well just put the screen on all the video on the screen where I originally shown the uh, the map but yeah the new bridges look really nice from a German community they offered to sell them to us so we're probably going to be buying those as well and uh, that's 
that's pretty much that. And I can see my money by going on my player info right here. This is like a really convoluted, confusing ass fucking video right now. Okay, it's hard to like lay out features. We're hoping there's some some cool shit that I'm mentioning here. What the fuck is that? Can you buy that? Sure. Huh? Can you buy that? I, don't, I have no idea. I have no idea. Wait, this is a, is this a vehicle? Oh, it is. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You can put those in your house. And oh, okay, cool. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and sign off as a cop. I wanted to quickly text you as well, repent and chill that. Okay. Yeah, this video, like, it's very scuffed Lewis. right now. It's very confusing, but I'm trying to show you stuff. What's up? What can do I do you want for? Me to give you a ticket so you can see the ticket? Do you want? Sure thing, boss. I, once I need to log off as a police officer, man. Also, you, can you go ahead and punch repent to me? Oh, no, sure. don't don't punch me. He's gonna punch him. Wow, you guys have probably seen that one before. You can punch people now, which means you can also uh, lean left and right while uh, unarmed. Due to that. But, uh, go off duty. So you see we're unemployed now. There's also the uh, job center where you can get jobs. In fact, you can also see that on your phone right uh, here. I don't know how all that shit works, but apparently it works, apparently. Um, yeah, I wanted to show texting quickly, Repent. So, Repent, go ahead and send me a text. I need your number. Uh, okay. Uh, I'll, I'll text you. I'll text you. I've got your number, I think. Kay. So, I'm going to go ahead and go to contact. I've already entered Repent into my shit before and we're gonna put an XD and then did you get that? I got it. Nice. Me, okay. Uh, Just text me back to my dude. And then uh, Ben, can you tell me your number? Uh sure. One seven oh nine. One seven oh nine. One seven oh nine. One seven oh nine. Four eight three. Yeah. Eight three six. Eight three six, alright. And then we're gonna go ahead and text you. You can also call people. But just for demonstration, we're just going to text people. Um, and I can go ahead and read my text from Repents. And this is like a nice messaging system. I feel like the life messaging system is a bit like, it's a bit scuffed. And um, a lot of the time you don't really know what the fuck's going on. But this you can see, you know, it's up to Repents. My text right here. It says soon TM. And I've got a text from uh, Ben who just texted me right now. It says sup. And we're going to apply to it and put like an XD. Did you get a text, uh, Ben? Yep. Wow, dude, it fucking works. So I just gave you a citation. Okay. Then. Killing fan. So boys. you'll just si sign your signature down the bottom, please. There you go. Oh no, I lost the money! I lost the money! Fuck. One second, I want to see that UI actually signing as, as cop. There's so much new stuff, like, basically Ben made this framework, and I haven't seen a lot of stuff in the framework. So, maybe that's, that's partially the reason why I'm all over the place. Violation committed, uh, murder of mans, and then... We've got a drop down, we've got a yes or a no, true or false, we're going to go true, we're going to give you a $1,000 ticket, my badge number is 123, issue, and then you should have that now. And then if you if you do that, does that give me money, or who does that give money to? Uh, it goes into the police funds. This I person can't cannot afford the ticket. Oh, nice. Alright, anyway, what do I have next on the list of things to show? We're going to go do some furniture stuff, or some mining stuff, what's up? Uh, let's go through some mining. Woo, mining! Okay, we're going to jump, jumps in the car. Jump okay, everyone jump in the... In the van. Oh, you can also jump on the side of this. Look at this. Wow. Revolutionary. You can also do that on the van behind us. Alright, we're there. It took about 50 hours to drive there because, you know, it's a big uh -oh. map. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh, I'm stuck. Uh -oh. oh, no, I'm uh -oh. stuck. Oh, no, I'm we're stuck. Ah! Oh. Okay, <laughs> oh, we're back. No we're back. Oh, 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 we're inside something. That's why. <laughs> we're inside something. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, you know, it's not early access. Basically, Ben spawned us. Inside. I mean, we didn't spawn anyway. What am I talking about? Uh, yeah, we're inside something, so, uh, are you okay down there? No. No? So Jeff's, who's Jeff? I forgot who Jeff is. Is that Repents? I think I called Repents Jeff a while ago. So, yeah, oh, hello. Hopefully you can okay, see the, the, you know, the, 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 the cool things here. Like, if you guys think this is wank and the armor's dead, just let me know. But, um, you know, hoping to revive it. You know, the modern server was an early access test. It was wank. It was wank. But now, oh, well, we've got pickaxes. I'm gonna go and give myself some, uh, some ammo as well. Just because he spawned it in for me. There we go. Alright, before I do mining, can one of you guys uh, go ahead and kill me so that way we can demonstrate the TFR stuff? So basically, you'll notice when you die, um, you, they can't Good hear job, me right boys. now. There's a different menu. Got it. Got it. it goes inverted. I can't look around or anything. And uh, you also ragdoll. So it's like a mix between. Oh, hello, I'm back. It's a mix between um, no pixel. Can you guys hear me? Hmm? Yep. Yeah. We can it's a mix between no no pixel because you still ragdoll, which no pixel didn't have, but it's also or it's like no pixel because you can hear people around you when you die. So you're not gonna hear like death chat or any of that shit. Let's see if I shoot repents. Why does this thing make a taser noise sometimes? It's really weird. I think it's gonna like scuffed. Like repents. I think it's the same idea as my taser. Ah, okay, well that explains it then. So uh yeah, when you kill someone you'll see if you ragdoll. 
Um, or we get forced to ragdoll kind of thing. Yeah, it might be because it's like using the same script as for Teza. And then after that, uh, for a few seconds after the ragdoll, so then you know you've killed them, uh, they'll go into um, the the normal death stance kind of thing that you'd see on no pixel. So yeah, that's pretty much fine. Anyway, let's go mine. And also, yeah, can can you re revive these two guys? Yeah, yeah. Don't but worry, man. I'm I don't chain medic. I don't have a physical. All the stuff works in this server, but essentially everything's physical. So there's not going to be like. Apples in your backpack and all, or not apple and apples in your backpack, but apples in your virtual inventory and all that stuff in your virtual inventory. So things like uh, bandages, CPR kits, um, everything is going to be physical, which has advantages because then you can rob people for it, but it also has disadvantages because, I, I, well, in fact, oh, I just got killed when he moves me over, I guess. That's not very good. <laughs> okay, it's fine. You'll pick me up in oh, a second. Unfortunately, uh, right. telephone people inside all people can but sometimes be very hurtful. But, uh, but yeah, I get picked up quickly. Some... Uh, Quick. Ben, do you know what are the advantages of uh, virtual inventories? Why do people like virtual inventories? Um, Unmodded. Part of the, it looks Unmodded, like okay. Yeah, um, I guess. And it, like, if wow. you don't have to like rob per a person's virtual inventory as well as their physical, like you can just take their gear and it's pat them all down, and everything in one place. So um, okay. the way this works. So what we'll do first is um, we'll mine some more what and we'll do some smelting. So what the fuck is this? Pickaxe. Yeah, I got a pickaxe. Oh, and, uh, uh, you can just start smashing just I've never seen, like, the full menus of those. Does this definitely work? Yep. Yeah. So, uh, and then below your feet, after a few swings, it'll create some ores. Will it? I oh, uh, yep. see there's one below your feet. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. Okay. Yeah, so, generally, you'll want to bring this over to one of these smelting machines. Dude, is this a free um, <laughs> Put it in, and Remember, you can make your iron anchor. Do, did, did you make these models? Uh, no, these are APO models. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, the system that April used to have. Uh, nice man, good shit. I mean, he removed it anyway. So like, you know, I, yeah, I don't know. Wait. Custom scripts, just the same models. <laughs> so you do not have required items. What do I have right now? I've got so, coal. Um, just... So wait, retrieve items. No, I don't want to retrieve. Oh, one second. What the fuck? Wait, I made coal. What? I, what? Um, yeah. um, um, what the fuck? I okay, don't know so what's was, going um, on. Oh, I picked it up. Oh no. Oh, I just killed him. Oh no. Oh no, I just killed Ben. Oh no, oh, no. Oh, no I didn't. Oh, okay. How do I put it down? Oh, drop. Tab, drop. Wait, can okay, you drop I'll this on top of someone? No, no, it won't drop with physics. That's uh. the stupid thing about armor. Yeah. I'm going to retrieve the items. Okay, I got your items. You got my items? So, okay, so... I, Does I, someone want to pick these ore up so I can get out? I don't know how exactly... I don't know if this is like a good system or a bad well, system. All I know is Aethrel removed it for a reason. Um, they did it a lot different to me, though. But there is also drug grown, right? Yeah, so... um, What I'll do is, if you want to... How much can we do? I'll drop some iron ingots here, so... You can... Grab these. Retrieve items. Come over to the um, crafting menu, uh, the workbench. Okay. And you can go into the crafting menu. It's just this one. So okay. pick up these iron ore. So we're gonna go ahead. I've got the iron ore. Let's see how much I've got right now. I've got like seven iron ingots. So now we can use workbench. And then I need like. So if you. I guess I'll just. The, maybe go into the item section and you can craft like a lockpick. Oh, you can craft a lockpick. Oh, I just crafted something back. I don't know what I'm crafting. <laughs> I double. No, I just, oh, wait. just executed that globally. Oh, you executed a script yeah. globally? Genius, man. To make us revive him. So we can make C4 so explosives. Can... Let's make a lockpick so we can see. Oh, it's going to take like, a while to You executed the wrong script. Oh. Okay, so I'm crafting a lockpick. Now can I press Maybe. escape? I can. Yeah. And we've got a progress okay, so... bar. Can I walk around yep. now? Yeah, you can just do that. Oh, I can just walk and around now. Walk in a bit. Away, oh, really? It'll oh, okay. Yeah, there's things in my way. Okay. What's that? Um, so this kind of like coincides with the furniture system as well. So the furniture system, yeah, the way yeah. it works. So, oh, yeah, you, you can explain if you want. It's up to okay. you. Oh, you explain it. You explain I'll explain it. it. I think I know. So, I mean, you can buy properties. We'll show that in a few seconds. Um, but basically, if you've got like furniture, like any of the furniture pieces in your house, then those will save every time you log in and out. But if you've got furniture outside your house, then those will essentially like fuck off on restart. So you can actually use like, we've got like, um, we'll show them in a few seconds, but like couches and shit like that, which you can use as roadblocks. Um, and stuff like that in any way you want. Obviously, not to be abused, but it just means a lot of flexibility. You can, you know, set up a roadblock or just do whatever you want with furniture. It might just be abused and it might just be a bad idea and you've got a speed radar for some reason, but um, it is what it is. But anyway, if you look inside our menu right now, you'll see you've got some lock picks, which I'm not sure how we use those. Is there any way we can use those right now? Oh no. Um, you have to get a car. 
and okay. because the cars are in conflict, you won't be able to find any of that work, but uh, oh. you just got to a car, double click it. Okay, well, let's see. I'm going to go craft one more thing. Let's craft, um, I guess we'll craft like a magazine or something. Do I have enough of that? No, I don't have enough required items. Let's see, do I have need, need like one more? No, I've got enough iron ingots. Um, wait, that's a steel ingot. Oh, shit. Let's oh. craft. Wait, iron, you can't craft anything of iron ingots. What? Oh, the only thing you can craft of iron ingots is lock picks. Can you give me some steel iron ingots? ingots. Iron ingots or a scam. will also be used for stuff with the blueprint system. Oh yeah, so there's blueprints as well. Do you ever, can you spawn in any blueprints or anything? But you can find blueprints underwater or some shit, and then you can craft more stuff or something. So you see right now, this menu is a bit, um, a bit shit. And shit, but, um, yeah, can you, can you spawn in blueprints, or is that not doable? Where are we right now, actually? Cool, man. That's nice. Uh, Ben? Uh, yeah, I'm just going. Oh, are you doing it? Oh. What's, what's the sage cage? What's sage cave? For what? Sage so here's some, here's some blueprints on the ground, some crafting nuts, saying, if you just man. want to pick them up. Oh, crafting and nuts. double click them in your inventory. Um, Where is it? I don't see it. Oh, there it is. Look in your inventory. Okay, I'm looking and at it. so I'm you'll get it. a blueprint from that. An M21 rifle? Whew! Is it, so is it random? Gonna get nerfed. Okay. These are going to get nerfed, but yes. I want to see yeah. what an M21 rifle is like, but let's have a, let's have a quick look at that. Ignore the ignore the screen right there. We'll fix it. It just doesn't mean uh, done by Connor. Okay, I made that screen and then fucked it. Uh, M21. One second. I've got an all clicker. You ready? <laughs> Wait, I killed everyone who can revive people. I don't know how to revive people. Is that a problem? You know, all clickers are pretty good, guys. I encourage everyone, if you're missing out already, to use an all clicker. You know, it's just like, it's a way to go. Like, did you see that? Imagine they were like, stop there, mate. Get on the ground. Are you there? And I'm just like, <laughs> <laughs> it's just so fast, man. Such a good all clicker, man. Anyway, that's pretty cool. So, I don't know if Ben can really, you know, show us everything today. I mean, we've got the weed system. Like, you can, like, get a plant pot, put it in your house, and, like, grow shit. There's a lot of weird systems. And I don't know if, like, with a complexity EV systems, it'll just be like mega scuffed. Um, what the fuck? Ben just like, what's Ben doing? I think he's like, okay, I'm back. you just, did you say globally execute something or something? He just like fucked me. I don't know. Um, yeah, I'm, did you did you like that? Was that impressive? Oh, that was amazing. Did you see my all click? I go yeah. ham, dude. It went fucking crazy, man. Dude, what the fuck is wrong oh. with me? Why am I sliding? You should go to the rage cage. What's a rage cage? I don't know. It's on the top of the map. Oh, it's a sage cave. <laughs> oh, the sage cave? You read it as a rage cage? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you got handcuffed, motherfucker. Alright, yeah, let's go to the sage cage, and then we're gonna go show the... Th is there anything else to show that you can think of, Ben, other than the furniture system? Uh, and then I'll show you the weed system. So well. how do you... So we can pick this up, right? But then how do we... Yep. How do we, like, get, uh... Like, get rid of it. How Can we eat it? Or like, you put it in your car. How do you put it in your car? Oh. Yeah, so, uh, and you can Did you get stuck the on that rock there, buddy? So, um, <laughs> just go up to the chuck press tab and you can look in the trunk. Okay. And then you can grab out your workbench. What happens if- oh. <laughs> <laughs> What happens if I drop it inside the car? <laughs> um, uh. And then, like, what happens if I drive the car when I've dropped it inside the car? <laughs> Oh. <laughs> yeah, I thought it might happen. Uh, okay, so that makes sense, man. That makes sense. So you're gonna move the stuff. You're gonna buy it from the store. You're gonna move it inside your car. Uh, yeah, you might want to like think about like something like anti video. I don't know how you're even gonna do that with furniture. I don't think you can. Uh, I can. I'll, I'll, All right. Where was a will? There's a way. God mode, by the way. Wait, what? God mode. All right, you got God mode. Yeah, I don't have God mode. Anyway, let's go ahead and um. Um. Go to a house. Let's go buy a house. Let's go buy a house. Yep. Okay. Um, I'll go teleport and teleport you guys to me. Okay. Oh wait, I want to go to I want to go to the bang bus or whatever. One second. Sage cage. What the fuck? Oh yeah, this is a sage cage. Of course, <laughs> it's a sage cage. So basically, yeah. this this thing that um, Connor made, like this is, I asked him like basically for like a, why the fuck am I like shit in the bed? What the fuck is going on? That's early access. Asked him for like somebody to throw people off of, and this is what he came up with. I don't know. These rocks are like kind of weird. It's like kind of concerning. Um. Oh. <laughs> okay. 
Oh. I don't know if I have one teleport midair or something. But yeah, this cave, this cave is like... I don't know, it's a, it's a cave. You can see, if you go inside here, it's actually a cave. Um, and he like kind of like ran out of ideas of what to do here. But uh, it's a cave. Uh, I don't know, it's kind of cool. You know, you can throw people off here. Make them walk for plank. Don't don't hit me. You think about hitting me? I'm giving you some keys. Hello? Oh. Ah. Oh no, I'm falling. I'm fine. Yeah, I think they uh, activated God mode on me. Anyway, let's go into the city to go buy a house. We can have a look at our place as well. You've got Harry's Hardware here. Basically, all of these menus are activated through tab rather than um, the normal scroll menu, which is good good and bad, I guess. It'll be a bit confusing, but you can think, buy things like plant pots. I don't actually have any money right now, so we're going to go to trucking job sign up right over there. Where's the ATM? Or where's the nearest ATM? How do you see where ATMs are? Are they marked? Uh, they should. I don't know if he's added them in. Yeah. Yeah. I'll, just, I'll give you some. Alright, just give me some money. Give me some dosh. Give me some dough. What is, what is this? This is. I just want to like buy something. I just want to show. Some money. Oh, five million! Wow, what a nice man. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, open shop. Yeah, we're gonna get a fucking. Um, we're gonna get a plant pot. We're gonna get a pickaxe. And we're gonna buy some band aids. We can buy some sausages. We can buy some tactical. Bacon and you know, I can only assume these things work. So you'll see in the bottom right right now You know, we're not looking too fly. So we'll go ahead and eat some sausages and now we're looking fly. We're gonna go ahead and fucking Wait, did I not get a drink? Fuck well okay. I'll a, you Wait, a bandage a, a, defibrilla a defibrillator used for reviving people? How does a bandage a fucking defib? What the fuck? You know, you can see the whole early access thing, you know, but the, the core thing, you know, it works. Alright, so we're doing with this house here. We're buying it yeah, so I'll buy us a house and then... Oh, no, I'll buy it. Out. I'll buy it. I want to buy okay. it. Which is... I don't... I don't uh, should I buy this house? Yeah. So can we... Do, are the doors, like, locked now? Or... Wait, the doors aren't locked? Yes. The doors aren't locked until someone buys the house. Oh, so, so you can, like, inspect it? Here. Okay, so I'm going to go yeah, ahead and man. purchase. We're going to sign it with, uh... Fuck you, repent. Confirm. Purchase successful. And then, um... How do we lock... How would we, like, lock a door and shit? So... Lock. Press tab and you should be able to lock it. Okay. And then unlock. And I can open it. And then, uh, what else can I do here? So, uh, well, this is your house. So, we'll make some furniture to start off, so... So, are we gonna craft the furniture? Uh, we can craft the furniture, but who cares for crafting, so... Oh, we'll just spawn it in. Okay, well, how would, how would you normally purchase the furniture? So, there's a furniture shop, which is pretty much just like a car shop, and it's got a spectator position and all. Oh, yeah, I forgot to... One second, I wanna go to, I'm gonna go to the, the Channel 7 News. Um, you, got, you guys stay here. Okay, I'll bring it back. We'll, we'll channel... dick out your house. We'll yeah, yeah, make it, make a, make, yeah, dick out my house. I know you're seeing deck, but since you dick, and it's funny. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go to Channel Seven News quickly. I want to show you guys this quickly as well. You know, there's a few things going on. You know, some things are broke, some things aren't. Um, I'm assuming this isn't broke, but you know, who who knows at this point? You know, some things are broke, some things aren't. It happens. Can we purchase this? We can't. Fuck. Where's Channel Seven News? I mean, it says it's right here. I think I got scammed. Like, where is it? Like, legit, I got scammed. Anyway, you'll notice here, there's a new section. So the way this works, which I think is a pretty cool idea. Um, you know, a lot of these things will like sync. Some things won't sync, but things like furniture obviously will. Uh, you know, if you've got multiple characters and shit. And I also you wouldn't notice before, when I press player info on someone else, it actually shows how much money they've got and stuff like that. So people can't lie about how much money they've got. Um, what was I going to say? But yeah, you can actually put news articles if you have the, the job for being a newsman. It's also the maps thing, which I've already shown if you press M. Uh, one second. I'll text dickhead quickly and see how do I get the news man job. But yeah, you do kind of need to. Oh no, you don't need to remember who's who. I just, I just realized you can literally put the name there, so like it doesn't matter what the name is. But yeah, it's just cool that all this shit works, and you can call people and talk to them over that, and you can see I can change. Wait, am I getting called? Oh no, that was this right here. So you can change your background. Um, you can turn on these. Jesus Christ, man, my ears. Oh, I got a new text message. Let's have a look. Uh, messages. He means as in the job on the phone. Oh, can I just join it from the phone, maybe? I'm not sure. Let's see. So, job market. Um, so, it looks like there's three pages. But there's definitely... There's, okay, we'll just go and teleport back to him, to be honest. Um, need a target. Yeah, I do mean the one on the phone. What the fuck are you doing? Oh, yeah. Wait, what is this? 
We're gonna set it up as an object that you can put in your house. Yeah, I mean, also on the screen right now, um, electric chair. Whoa. Uh, yeah, it, it's not on. The, it's not on the menu. Yeah, I've just I've just assigned you as a newsworker now, so you should be able to go in there and uh, go into the news and make an article. But how do I? Oh, this hurt me. What's wrong with you? Hurt me. Who are you? Do it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna chop your legs off. Fuck. Oh. Oof. Oof. One second. Oh. <laughs> that's now that's hurtful. That is some some serious pain right there. Uh, yes, you said I need to, um, how do I make a news article? Because I didn't see any NPC at the NPC so, place um, or at the news place. what you'll do is now that you're a cop, uh, I just assigned you, so go into the news app on your phone. Yeah. And you'll now see a little plus button in the bottom left. Oh, yeah. So, so you'll be able I'm, to go in and... I'm going to put, I'm going to put secret information. You guys are going to read out what the secret information is to prove it works, right? Okay, um, yep. one second. Yeah. Um... There you go. Okay, go ahead and tell me what it says. Um, Donald Trump and Bitcoin is great, and I should buy Bitcoin. It's amazing. Um, yeah. yeah. Oh. oh, no. Piece of nine. No. Okay. So, uh. Make some torture equipment. Oh, so you can actually pick up this stuff. Okay. Wait, how do I pick. Oh, it's. Wait, what? Oh, so this has got. Wait, how do I pick this up? Um. This individual object you won't be able to pick up just because it's and not you, in the furniture can't forget. And how the fuck are you picking but, um, it up? Are you some kind of cool man? Can you I just spawned it in. So then what the fuck is this? What the fuck is that? Shelf. So you so I can't pick them up because you guys are spawning them in, right? Yeah, yeah, because we're spawning them in. Okay. And then apparently this stuff will save if I log out, correct? Uh, it'll save if you place it, yeah. Hmm. Interesting. So what you telling me? Oh, I don't know about this. Can I go into a man's house, steal his fridge, and then bring it back to my house? Yep, and place it down, and it'll save. So, so if you want to go steal his fridge, go go ahead. Really? So just to confirm, this amazing new server, I can restrain people and make them move. I can mine things and craft things. I can experience an epic new map. I can be a female with bobs. I can be butt naked as a female, and I can steal people's fridges. What's the point of playing on any any other server with all those features listed off right there? Where's the competition? Huh? Huh? That's not an empty-ended question. I want I want to answer. Don't know. You don't know. You don't know where the competition's at. So, I, yeah, I don't know. What? Well, so what? Watch out, all this life. All this life? Yeah, all this life is pretty Alice good. Alice. Is it, I, I think we might be done here. Are we done here? Is this everything? Uh, no, we we also plan on okay. Let's find a tractor. There's a tractor in the. Why do we need a tractor? What? Oh, listen to Ben. He's breathing. He's excited. Why do we need a tractor? Because we're gonna make it so that there's gonna be like pot fields and like wheat fields and shit that you could harvest only with the tractors. And Dude, you're overcomplicating things, dog. You need to calm down, man. Let's take it one step at a time, you know. <laughs> Sounds like a a lake. Please sign your name. Jeff. Hey, it's my house now. So if I, I go ahead and close this door house. and then lock. Haha, now you're all locked in. Oh, but, uh... But what? Wait, how did you open it? I unlocked it. Oh, we've got a tractor, repents. It's We have much better tractors. Oh, uh, you mean one on no pixel mid? Nice one. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is an armor 2 tractor right here. Yes, we fucking did. Who made them then? VVV. I like this tractor. This tractor's got like look at this fucking turning radius. Oh, that's a I mean that's a Vodnik from armor 2. Like, why is it? What's that doing there? I wonder if it's actually bulletproof. I love a Vodnik, dude. It's so sick. What's this fucking horn though? But I mean, there's many. There's get in. Get in, Jeff. You can get in, yeah, there you go. Should be in the back. Yeah, what's up, my dude? Dude, this is so armor too. I mean, so many possibilities for pants. vehicles. There's so many possibilities for vehicles that you can put in, you know? Like, we've got- yeah, we, have an, we have an armor two vehicle mode. But yeah, just a little side note while I drive around here, but um, in case you want to know what like, the delays and stuff were for, essentially we were using someone else's framework, not the original Tortonic framework. 
I think that's the dude who made like the popular RSI framework. We're using an R framework for pretty much the last or I guess for three weeks after there hasn't been an update at all on the main server since all the developers were focusing on this server. And uh, eventually we decided to use Ben's framework instead since it just seemed to be a better option. And we've been using it for the past few days now. So a lot of things still don't work, but the progress that's been made in the past few days has been pretty good. Obviously the map is still going to get updates courtesy of Connor and there's a lot of things which I haven't necessarily shown in this video, which is why I obviously linked to that completely separate video. And if you guys are developers who, you know, want to try to help out or whatever else, then obviously, you know, there's apps on the forums or you can go and go come on team speak like we're trying to make something work i do feel like there's still a lack of um talent in the armor free scene with developers especially ones in you know the life sector like there's just not how many like the armor free life mod just isn't as big as it used to be i doubt it'll ever be big again but it's still fun which is why i continue to play it um but yeah you know if you're interested then we'd love to have you on uh there's a decent amount of developers right now working alongside each other to try to do something a bit different Nothing too crazy. We're still, you know, big, big props up to you, like, servers like A3PL. They're still going to be the most modded server out there, but we still do have some features they don't have, like the, you know, moving and restraint shit, I think is really cool. Um, and as a whole, they have a really, really keen roleplay server. Not to say our server's going to have no roleplay, but I want it to be somewhere in between, I guess, A3PL and ALRP. And in terms of features, obviously we do want some unique features against our servers. Otherwise, really, what is the point of playing on them? I played on way too many servers in the past few years on Armor, Free Life, like I said before, which are simply copy and paste of Tortonic framework with some different shops around locations, um, you know, with maybe a different weapon pack or maybe a different vehicle pack on a different map. And that just doesn't cut these days. You need something different. There's a lot of things you can do with Armor Free, as you would have seen in the video I uploaded yesterday. A lot of you guys didn't like it <laughs> because it was like literally Super Mario <laughs> on my YouTube channel. I'm not really a Super, Super Mario 64 YouTuber, unfortunately. But um, yeah, that video was uh, a good demo of what you can do with armor. You can do a lot of cool things with armor. So yeah. Anyway, gonna finish the video in our fire thing. I don't know why, but we do. But yeah, that's that's my speech over. And I mean, it's not actually my speech over, but if you guys didn't see my video yesterday as well and you wonder where, where all the videos have been, it's been purely just because I just wanted to play this update. I wanted to play something and record it. And I didn't really have anything I really wanted to record. I really want to play some more free life obviously, and I'm waiting for Identity coming out in March. Um, but other than that, was nothing else that really was too exciting for me to play. So that's pretty much why I didn't make videos. And obviously, Modern is just boring at this point. It just hasn't been updated. This server, well, this is what the developers have been focusing on. So hopefully this this works out and we should have um, quite a lot of people on it since the framework runs well, runs well and shit uh, when, it, when it does come out. And yeah, and we can steal people's fridges. I just want to steal people's fridges. That'd be great. You can't? No, you can't close hatch. There we go. Wait, the close hatch button doesn't do anything. Oh no, there we go. I can't get in. What are you doing? Why are you on the floor? Are you okay? <laughs> what? <laughs> well, what? Uh, what the fuck is this? What's cool about this? Tell me. It's a helicopter. Okay, what's cool about this one? You can fly it. Wow, it's a helicopter and you can fucking fly is it. Is that a snake? What are you talking about? A snake is flying. What are you talking about? Watch, I'm gonna do a backflip, I'm gonna do a backflip. Disembark! And he's fine. Well, that's great. I'm just so happy to be alive. Do I have god mode on? Yeah, you do. <laughs> I was gonna say, I fucking hope I do. Alright, is this it? Is that it, Repent? You got anything else? What's up? What else is on the schedule? Wait, you snake? Let me see. Yeah, not quite. It's like a scuffed snake. Is anything else? Or is that everything? Is that everything, Ben? This there's probably not that much that's going to be interesting to viewers that's not like kind of grindy. Grindy. Yeah, alright. <laughs> anyway guys, that's it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, uh, you know, leave a like. If you didn't, drop a dislike. Um, you know. Uh, we'll see how it turns out. You know, I don't develop. I just like show you guys what's going on for development. So I'm hoping. Um, it doesn't blow. Uh, it might blow. I fucking hate Malden. I just want to play something that isn't Malden. Like, legit, if it wasn't ALRP right now, without Malden, which obviously ALRP never had Malden, I'd play it, you know? But there isn't. I mean, there is, but like, no one plays it. Also, these things right here I thought were funny. You see the vehicles are actually under the water. Um, because there's a lot. Because I, 
I haven't reconfigured the business. It's got early access. <laughs> it's fine. And there's too, there's too many. So this is the cheap cars. This is the expensive cars you can see right here. So it can get a Maserati oh, Sport. I just bought myself a nice car, African-American person. Okay. I liked that. Uh, that was funny. Uh, is this my car? Is it? Wait, where's my car? Wait, why is there a sigh here? That's a sigh. Um, wait. Oh, this is yeah. This is my car. Okay, and we've got a car. And then if I want to give you my car keys, I can give you my car keys. Oops. Oops. Um. Dude, I can't. There we go. All right, later, losers. Skirt. Hi, man. That was some nice driving, man. <laughs> Is it out? Is it out? Is it out? Is it out? It's a tough player. It's just a Well, what are you shooting me with? What the fuck is that? Dude, this fucking fire, man! Stop fucking shooting me! Stop it! Who's that? Who are you? <laughs> Wait. 